Hello everybody, today I bring you a short update concerning SpaceX. They are putting an end to the production of Dragon capsules, thus keeping the fleet at a total of 4 capsules once their last Freedom capsule becomes operational, although they will continue manufacturing components for refurbishing as well. The main reason for this shift is the reallocation of resources onto the Starship program, to which SpaceX will be adding more urgency since Starship will be the successor not only of Dragon but also of Falcon 9 and it will also be the rocket that will take humans back to the moon and later on to Mars. We know that SpaceX have had difficulties with the production of their Raptor engines, especially with Raptor 2, so it's definitely a good thing that they are dedicating more resources to it. The company's president added that they will retain the capability to build more capsules if it were necessary, but the priority right now is fleet management. So far, Crew Dragon has flown five crews of government and private astronauts to space since 2020, when it flew its first pair of NASA astronauts, thus becoming the space agency's go-to ride for getting humans to and from the International Space Station. SpaceX has flown a total of four crews to the ISS under NASA contracts at roughly $255 million per flight, plus one fully private mission last year called Inspiration4, carrying four passengers on a three-day trip around Earth, and there are plenty more flights to come, both private missions and missions under NASA contracts, such as resupply missions to the ISS. However, SpaceX's current goal is to someday replace everything that Falcon 9, Falcon Heavy and Dragon can do with the biggest and most powerful rocket humanity has ever witnessed. And that's it for this little update. See you again soon in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.